An East County neighborhood is shaken up this evening after a woman was killed in a shooting. Thank you for joining us on this Tuesday. I'm Kimberly Hunt. The scene unfolded when sheriff's deputies were called to a house on La Presa Avenue in Spring Valley. Inside, they found a woman with gunshot wounds. ABC 10 News reporter Rachel Bianco is joining us live from the neighborhood where deputies have a person of interest. Rachel? Hi, Kimberly. Investigators aren't releasing any information about that person, but they say there is no threat to this community. Still, to all the people coming home from school and work, a large area is still a crime scene. Arely Barrera walked to pick up her son at La Presa Elementary after getting a text about roads closed due to police activity. What's happening, and is it like... It must be serious for like the whole street to be blocked because it's literally like blocks and blocks. Mm -hmm. um, so I quickly like rushed over to walk to pick up my son. Investigators blocked off a large section of La Presa Avenue to investigate a homicide. It happened at a house that's for sale in the 800 block. Deputies say a relative not living in the house called about a disturbance just before 1030 Tuesday morning. The call was updated to someone trying to break in the house. When deputies got here, no one answered. They went around the back and found a woman on the couch with trauma. A homicide lieutenant at the scene won't say the cause of death, but a sheriff watch commander told 10 News earlier that a woman had been shot. Oscar Brown has lived in the neighborhood for more than 30 years. I turned down La Presa and they had obviously tapes and then our officer said it was a homicide. Like I said, this is unusual. Investigators confirm a nine-year-old boy connected to the address was missing for a short time, but found. The child was not in the house when the violence unfolded. They won't say if he's the victim's son. They aren't releasing details about the relationship between the victim and suspect, but they say they have a person of interest and there is no threat to the community. Still, the crime scene is unsettling to neighbors. It's usually really calm, like my kids are able to play outside the front lawn. Again, several blocks of La Presa are blocked as people come home from work. Deputies are escorting them to their homes. They have not released the victim's name. We're reporting live in Spring Valley, Rachel Bianco, ABC 10 News.